This is a 1976 AMC Pacer. This car matters because it's an icon car for America. It was very popular during its original production, which ran from 1975 to 1980. The vehicle was originally supposed to have a Wankel engine, but General Motors pulled the plug. They wound up shoehorning in the AMC straight six cylinder. The vehicle's engine wasn't quite powerful enough for the heavy weight of the car. By 1980, they pulled production. In the end, AMC floundered and was finally bought by Chrysler during the 80s. Originally, the car lived in Tucson, Arizona on an army base for 31 years. The fact that it was in a dry environment is the only reason it's still here. In 2008, a gentleman bought the car and proceeded to have the interior done and the car repainted with the original color, which is Aztec copper. This vehicle was conceived by Richard Tiag, who was a designer, and he was inspired by watching a football. If you look at its profile, it is shaped like a football. They also wanted to make this car have innovations. For instance, this door is four inches wider than that door for easier ingress. It has side impact beams, inertia seat belts. It's my everyday driver, and I intend to use it for many years to come. Every design engineering weakness in this car has been addressed and corrected. The back hatch lid had palm dents. I said, I'm going to add this bar so I can grab a hole of it instead of pushing in and denting. The third stoplight is extra LEDs in the taillights. I have a plastic skid plate underneath the gas tank. I put in a remote release. I added a lot of features into the interior mostly for my own personal use. I put power windows, power door locks, which were not available during 75, 76. Whenever I take it to a show, I steal the show. I didn't intend on this happening, but people will see my car and a goofy little smile comes over their face like they saw an old friend. And I'm glad to be able to give them that opportunity to reminisce and remember. I'm Gil Pepitone and this car matters.